In this short video I'm going to show you how to find your API codes um, in Stripe. It's pretty straightforward, but before we dive in we should be aware of one thing. There's two sort of versions within your Stripe account. You can be in test mode or live mode. A test mode is used for testing a website and um, where you're not using real money. Um, live mode is when you're using real money. Um, Currently you can see here we're logged into Stripe and we're on the home page and we're in test mode. See how it says test data here. If this particular um, account was set up um, and ready to take live payments then we'll be able to toggle into live mode. Down here you can see there's a toggle and by clicking that if we were fully ready then we'd be able to go into live mode. And if you're um, looking for your live API codes to use for real money, you'll need to be in live mode to achieve that. So um, I'm simply going to show you how to find your API codes for a test website. If you want them for the live website, you need to toggle into live mode and then repeat the same process. I'll point out a couple of other things to look for to ensure you got the right codes as we work through this. Okay then, so API codes, we need to look on the menu on the left hand side here on a desktop um, system um, and look for developers. Click on that. Here we can see at the top of the list here API keys. Click on that and there we have two versions of the key, a publishable key and a secret key and we'll need both of these. Um, I want to take um, the token, the, um, the code for the publishable key and I'm going to copy that paste it into my notepad and I'll use that later on the website that I'm using this on and we'll minimize this down and now we need to find the secret key. We want to reveal the secret key and um, you may sometimes need to put your password in again to have that revealed especially when you're using the live tokens um, and then again we're going to copy that out and take that across to um, notepad where we're going to paste it in and I'm going to point out a couple of things. So these are our um, test API codes for our a publishable key and our secret key. Notice how it says PK for um, publishable and SK for secret. Also it then says test and test showing that this is our test version. If you were to get the live version it would say live there in both cases for publishable and secret which would confirm that these were live co um, tokens that could be used for taking real money. So once you've got these codes you can then take them into any website or situation where it's asking for them and then save them into your website to take um, payments. Okay, um, hopefully this shows you how to find your API keys and explains the difference between your live versions and your test versions. Okay, cheers for now.